Creo Parametric 11 has introduced a search tool in the options dialog box that works a lot like the command search function in the interface. So for example, if I go to the upper right hand corner of the interface, this is the command search. Let's say that I haven't used Render Studio in a while and I want to find where it is. I can start typing in the name. If I hover my mouse over the search result, it will show me where the command is in the interface. And I can actually execute the command from here. Let's say I'm looking for the new performance report. Well, let me start typing in performance and I can hover my mouse over one of the results. Hey, there it is on the tools tab from the investigate overflow menu. Let's take a look at doing it from file options. I'll go to file and then here is options and I'll click on it. It opens up the options dialog box and here we have our search bar for looking for the various options. On the right hand side of the bar, there's a little gear icon. These are for the settings for the search. And right now it's set to search for the option in the user interface and also in configuration options. I'll show that in a moment. You can also search in the tool tip for the different options. You can choose to match the case and we can match criteria with any word beginning with that phrase or containing or ending with. All right, let me cancel out of the search settings. Let's say I am a brand new user and I want to figure out where the heck do I change the background color? Well, I will start typing in background and here are the different search results. Let me scroll up a little bit and here we have system appearance background. I can see that one in there and you can click in here just to go to the relevant category where it appears in the option dialog box. Another example, let's say you are trying to learn more about the options and you just want to explore. Let me type in the word shade. And here we have a number of different results. So for example, shaded edges, where we have shaded model display settings, and let's see, shade closed loops. That is for sketching. You can see all the different ones that have shaded in the name. Let me jump down to another one. Oh, here are a bunch of config options that are not in the user interface. Okay, for the next example, let's say that you are trying to get to a command that you haven't used in a blue moon. Let's say you are looking for your model check settings. So I will start typing in model check. And once again, I might need to scroll up to the top of all the different results. Hey, if I go to the environment category, that's where I can get to my model check settings. And again, I can just click on it from the search results in order to stay on that particular category. A couple more examples. Let's say that I have been checking that box to close a whole bunch of dis different dialog boxes and I wanna get back to it. Well, let's start typing in dialog box and let's see, checkpoint dialog box. Oh, resume display of dialog boxes. Let me click on that. And here we have that button to change that setting. And like I mentioned earlier, it will also search for config.pro option. So for example, let me type in obsolete for a config option. And here we have configs that are in the user interface. And then there's this other one here for configs that are not in the user interface, but here we can go to enable obsoleted features, uh, which is in the interface. So there you have it. That is how you can use the new search tool in the Creo Parametric Options dialog box.